Hi, good morning. I have to look at the time. Is it still morning? <laughs> yes, it's 10.30. I had a day, guys. It's 10.30 and I had a day already. <laughs> I had a day worth of a week. I don't know. It was a hassle all morning long. Okay. I have no idea what to do. So I decided I will just, you know, grab another picture from my screenshots and do it. And it looks very similar. And this one is from Corey too, because I just can tell on, you know, some, some of them. However, oh, I show you the picture that I have <laughs> and um, then we will just continue. Okay, so that was the picture and it looks like normal, right? It's it's nothing, it's not something new or something I've never done before or something like that, but it's inspirational to me. So basically that's it. I, I saw her showing this and I took a screenshot. I watched her video. This is on YouTube. So if you go there, you can find it. I don't know what video it is. <laughs> I cannot tell, but one of her videos. And um, I just thought, oh my God, I have a whole bunch of these flower cards. I should just sit down and use them. And mostly, why is my finger so dirty? I don't know. <laughs> I was cleaning already and everything and coffee dying. I'm sorry. They're super dirty. However, what was I saying? I don't know what I was saying. I, I, I will just, <laughs> oh, mostly I sit down here not to make something for sale or, you know, make something for giving it to somebody. I don't have swaps or anything going on just because I, I feel like I'm stressed out and I have a hard time swapping with people because I don't know when I can do it, how I can do it. <laughs> and I hate swapping a certain, certain theme because I might not be able to do this theme in this amount of time. Maybe I feel like creating creating something completely different, you know, and then it stresses me out, even though it's so good. I miss it, but it also, like I said, it also stresses me out. So I don't know. However, mostly I come here to just relax and for my, my mental health. It's the most important thing here. So what she had was just flower pictures and then some strips of paper and a number. So that should be quick, right? I'm just gonna take out four <laughs> because mostly I take out 10 and then I finish two. And I'm like, oh my God, what were you thinking? I'm always so positive that I'm gonna do so many more. But I do have these little strips. I have a container where I keep the bigger things and I have one where I keep the smaller things. So yeah, should I tell you about this morning? I don't know how long I can craft because BJ has been very naughty. He doesn't go to sleep for more than a couple minutes and then he comes out and then he barks and then he, you know, he wants to go outside and then it's fine. <laughs> but he always takes a nap in the mornings where I can go and, you know, do something here. I need this too. I am a dog mother, but I don't live just for my dog if that makes sense if if i would do that i i would be dead by now i need to do something for myself especially with my poor mental health so i'm always waiting for him to fall asleep in the morning so i come out can come out here and you know just do this it doesn't work when he's not sleeping he he just, I told you so many times, he will just bark and he will come visit me here and then he will just lay down there and bark until I come. So that makes no sense to start anything when he's awake. It's okay. He's just, you know, I want this a little more kind of, yeah, I think that's good. Um, He's just old and Luna is not like this. Luna is sleeping right here, right now. <laughs> Once again, not far from the door so she can, you know, protect me in case something happens. So he wouldn't go to sleep. And then I was, I decided, okay, I'm going to work in the living room. And remember in one of my videos, I, um, spoke about all the pocket letters and stuff that my daughter got and I didn't know what to do with them. So I was um, talking to one of um, the people who swapped. I don't have, um, I'm not in contact with all of them, but I was talking to one and uh, she said, you know what? You can totally take mine apart. You can rip it apart. You can do whatever you want to do. And 
you know, with this permission, I kind of decided, you know, I spoke to Michelle, she doesn't want to keep it. What do we do with that? So I took it apart and whatever I could, I put in a pile that I will gift to my customers because those are really pretty things and I cannot keep them all. And I will gift and then I made another pile that I can use in the kind of craft I'm doing right now. So I was doing that. And while I was doing that, there was a loud noise behind me. I almost died. For a second there, I think I did die. <laughs> and I go to the backyard and a, a bird flew in our window. So there was this noise and then there was a bird, like super loud bird, but that was not the one that flew in the window. It was another one. I don't know if it was the mother or what, but this bird, it was just laying there all cricket and I thought it died. And I was terrified and I was stressed out. I didn't know what to do. And then it started moving. And so, oh my God. I wanted to call the vet. Then the, I realized I don't even have a car. What am I supposed to do? And, you know, I went outside and I petted and I told it that he's going to be all right. So he was sitting there. I should craft, right? But, <laughs> oh my God, I'm going to cry. He was sitting there with his eyes closed for over half an hour, not moving, you know? And then, thank God, he flew away. So, but that was a long time. I sat there with him for a long time, too. Because I just wanted him to be okay and know that he's not alone. <laughs> That's probably stupid, but you know, it just I just wanted my birdie to be okay. Okay, so what do I want to do? I would like to go like that, I think. Just some strips. So that's all we want to do, right? Ooh, I'm thinking, why not put it on coffee dyed paper? I have some coffee dyed paper here. So this could be cool too, right? Kind of like this. And then have it a little longer and have a little yeah why not right <coughs> so yeah that happened and then i i thought okay maybe while bg doesn't sleep i should do my chores so i start doing my chores and every time i start doing something he wants to go outside <laughs> And when he wants to go outside i cannot go vacuum upstairs or something like that because you know bg when he was younger he would bark and wait till I come to open the door, right? So to let him back in. But now he just keeps barking. So he comes up to the door. He wants it to be open. He barks and he just keeps barking. He sees you coming. It doesn't matter. He just keeps barking until this door opens. So yeah, if I'm upstairs until I come up downstairs, if I hear him at all, it's a long time. So I'm going to use this side because it's not as dark. Yeah, however, I couldn't do my chores. And then I was just, I did phone calls. Everything I could do in the living room next to him, I did. And it's 10.30 only, but I've done everything now. So, and he finally, I ate already. I ate lunch already. But I wake up very early, so I always eat lunch around 10, 11, something like that. I cannot wait longer. I should have waited till he, this dries, but of course I can't. Okay. You know what? I can. Let this dry and let's just do the other ones, please. Okay, however, long, exciting day. And you know what? You know what? This week, I don't know, did I tell you that? I think I did. This week they are going to install our solar system. And yesterday, day before yesterday we finally got the notification that we can pick up our car so they come to install the solar system on wednesday and then we got the notification you can come get your car on wednesday we're like oh my god now everything happens on a wednesday you know you're waiting there forever we um wanted the car when was it when we where did it so february i think so if i'm not wrong and now it's May, <laughs> so it took a long time. And now it all goes like so quick. Oh, your car is done, get it in two days. <laughs> but I moved the appointment, we, we are gonna get it later. We're gonna get it on Friday because Wednesday and Thursday, they are gonna be putting our solar system on, on our roof. So yeah, am I making one that is 
wider yeah why not it's kind of no good for my brain to have different <laughs> different sizes here but hey we'll we'll manage right um no this will be too how far am i ripping this like that right and then somewhat here so wednesday thursday they are putting it up and they said they might cut our um, power <laughs> power for up to four hours I'm like oh my god what do i do without internet we don't even have cable <laughs> everything in this household depends on internet <laughs> so yeah we'll see <laughs> michelle took a day off for wednesday because of luna you know luna is gonna stress me out if so, so many people are working there she's just gonna be stressing so michelle took a day off and then on thursday i will take care of luna I have a hard time doing it by myself for two days. I know I'm going to be very sick afterwards. So it was good. That worked out. She worked on Sunday. So she basically worked her days. And instead of being off on Sunday, she's going to be off on Wednesday. And then Friday, we will get the car finally. And I hope that, you know, when they put your solar on your roof, you can't use it right away. I thought you can. Like, that was my believe like they put it up and it's good but no somebody has to allow it and it could take some time too so we will see and now once they put it up they messaged us already and said that they cannot um they are like i don't know backlogged on something so we will not be able to see our power consumption or not the consumption but the solar power produced because they didn't have something and it's gonna come in by the end of summer okay i need some more glue right here so yeah we'll see how that all of it works out i'm stressing out because all of it is a commitment of course money wise and i'm having a really hard time with money it's just i think you know it's because of my experiences that i had you know, I ended up one time not having any money and having, being alone with my children, three kids, no money. There was difficult. <laughs> there was, that kind of put something in my brain and now I'm concerned about money all the time. But, you know, I managed, it, it was okay, but it was just overwhelming back then. However, <clears throat> we will be good. Wow, I talk a lot. <laughs> I'm very talkative today. You know, I had the problem this morning and I noticed once I did it here while I was talking too. Maybe you didn't notice, but I did. Um, I tried to say something to Luna, like Luna go away because she, or get out of there or something. She was getting into something. And instead of get out of there, I said something like, Creme is her affair. So, which made no sense at all. And my anxiety just, boom. I was like, oh my God, what's happening? Am I having a stroke? Because I said something that was just, I put all of the letters in one pot and it just, you know, they just flew out there. It was terrible. But I'm good for now, I think. Now I'm good. I think. You know, I kind of like the cards as they are. I don't even need to make anything on the side. I kind of like them as they are. But I want to use up those little strips of paper that I have this um, here everywhere you know they're just leftovers uh, I need to see if I feel like any of them yeah we can do some some here and one of them here and this is very blue I don't know what I don't know what goes with blue guys what what goes with blue <laughs> anybody can anybody tell me Ooh. yeah that's me that's why i have oh i want to use this that's why i have such a hard time using colors because i feel like nothing goes with this and nothing goes with that oh, what? do we have any other strip there are roses and there are just book page strips right here what is this one I don't know. Maybe just like this piece. Do I cut it? Do I rip it? Shall we do stuff like straight or? 
And so I'm thinking you need to put one right here. Shall we put one? That's so much. Look. And if I put something more there, I kind of don't like it. I don't know if I want to put that. Oh. How about... What goes with blue? Somebody tells me what goes with blue, then, you know, I will be fine. I have a ruler here. Oh, that part, that kind of, kind of could work, right? It could work. Oh, on the weekend, I finally got my freezer, chest freezer. Put myself a chest free. I think that could work. I don't know. I'm just going to glue it down there. Oh, I'm going to distress it first. I got a chest freezer. Now that we will have solar, I'm thinking, hmm, it's, it's okay. You know, I didn't get one because, yeah, it's electricity and we don't really need one since we have a freezer in the kitchen. But it's always, because I'm one person who buys meat on sale, I buy meat on sale and I make my own ground meat. You know, if it's on sale, so I can grind it and I freeze it and I buy chicken and at Costco, which are big packs. And then, you know, it's always full. And then Michelle is somebody who always buys all those big packs of something. There is fruit, there is this, there is that. And my husband buys and then I'm like, oh my God, it's always a mess. And my freezer <laughs> in Germany, I had a system for my freezer that was perfect. I had a list what's in my freezer. Every time I took something out, I scratched it off my list. So I always knew what's in my freezer. Right here? I have no idea. I have to go through everything to know what's in there. So yeah, that's terrible. I decided to fix that and get another chest freezer so I can put all of my meat there. And I got it and on like when we were there to pick it up, we were there with my husband to look at it and everything was fine. We looked at it and we went home and next day we went there to pick it up with Michelle. And Michelle is my, what you call it? I don't know. She, she always, she always makes me buy stuff. <laughs> Let's say it this way. She's like my nemesis. No, I don't know. I don't know what you would call it. But um, yeah, same situation, same Costco, same freezer. But next to the freezer, there is a vacuum. And Michelle like, oh, don't you want another vacuum? Because mine is like, you know, dying. <laughs> and I have the handheld Dyson, I think it is. Oh, if you can afford it, you should get it. Because the best vacuum ever. I will never go back to any other vacuums that you have to plug in or something, you know. Because that's the best that it just is it is what it is the best one ever however this one was from lg and it has two batteries you know my dyson the only thing i don't like about it is it dies quickly because i always um, vacuum on turbo because of the hair and then you know it just i'm, I'm thinking I, I i i need something underneath <laughs> so this one has two batteries and you put one in there it charges and the other one charges in a different spot so basically all the time you have two charged batteries and I'm like what that's so cool I like it I love it and then yeah however got the vacuum guys <laughs> now now I have two of them <laughs> plugged in right there <laughs> next to my room <laughs> so I'm gonna bring the the old one upstairs this way I don't have to run back and forth what is this piece I don't know. I'll put this piece on there. Well, you know what? Ha! Huh. I'm going to. I will put this piece on there. And then, I don't think, I don't know if she has it on hers. Could be. But I'm going to sew right straight here. That's what I'm going to do. So, yeah. However, ended up with two vacuums. And then I, and this is my usual thing too. When I came home with the vacuum, I started feeling guilty and I had right away, I feel like taking it back. You know, I buy it because I want it and then I bring it home and right away, I feel like taking it back. Just because I feel so guilty about spending money, it's terrible with me. 
you know, I don't know. I don't want to feel this way, but I do. Okay, this looks good. <clears throat> However, I vacuumed with it. It's good. It's, you know, I like it. I, I got to keep it. I can't just always feel guilty about stuff. It's no good. I don't know how I want this. Do I want it like that? And then have these going on top? Could be, because I, I do like it. I'm just wondering about the hearts. Do I, do I not? Yeah, I do. I'm gonna keep them. Hearts are good. I'm gonna cut this perforated piece, kinda don't want it there. Oh, what else happened in our lives? Ooh, I tried a new recipe. Oh my God, was the best salmon ever. Oh my God. <laughs> you know, we, we do eat salmon, I don't know, about, I don't know. We used to eat it once a week. Now we eat it a little less just because it was, you know, like, eh, we ate it recently. I want something thinner here. I don't know. We just ate it last week. We don't have to eat it again, <laughs> you know, but... um. I have a recipe. It's so good. I think I'm going to go with this. I'm going to cut it first and then see if I want to go with this. It's basically salmon with spinach and Parmesan and heavy cream and garlic and parsley and oh, roasted peppers. It's basically heaven. Okay? It's, it, it is. It's heaven. It's so good. <laughs> I, I don't know if I'm going to make it any other way. We normally just fry it. <coughs> Excuse me. I normally just fry it. You know, I put salt and pepper there. And I fry it up. And I like it this way. And then we cook some broccoli. Or I do. And I really like it this way. But this was out of this world. Does it work? Is it too much? Do not know. Where is a piece of paper? I just need a piece of paper to destroy this. I feel like it's very... Is this pink? Would you call this color pink? Because I would. <laughs> I got... I got a... Um, order sometime a, a little while ago. <laughs> I was laughing so hard. Did I tell you about this? I don't even know. If I did, I apologize. But somebody ordered um, flower die cuts. And then, you know, I say, you can, if you want something special, you can always message me. If I can do something for you, I will. So somebody ordered flower die cuts. And then she she left a message and she was saying like, okay, um, if possible, she was very nice. It was nothing wrong with that. But if possible, she wanted, and I forget, but sage, sky blue, baby pink, and she, she didn't say that, like, red, yellow, green, but a special kind of green, like, she wanted sage, or this kind of green, or that kind, and I was just like, okay, <laughs> if you only knew that I have no idea what you just said there. <laughs> I don't know these colors. I don't know that. I have to Google it. I went to my husband and I'm like, please tell me what kind of colors these are. And then I Google a picture and I show him and I'm like, would you say this is sky blue? <laughs> People assume that I know the difference between blue and sky blue and baby blue. <laughs> no. Blue is blue for me. <laughs> I'm like, um. <laughs> so I... I found what I thought was what she wanted, and then I sent her a picture first. That's what I always do, because, yeah, guys, if you order a certain color in my store, and you don't just say green, then, yeah. <laughs> then you will, you will get a picture from me asking if that's the color that you mean, <laughs> because I got no clue. I got no clue at all. But about shades of colors. Oh, well, that was too funny. Yeah, some bad thing. Well, bad. 
I don't know. It depends on how you see that. But it was not very nice to me. <laughs> it didn't feel very nice. But the other week, I got a message from a customer. And she said, you sent me the wrong item. I was like, oh my God, really? That, that, oh no. So basically what happened was, and then I looked up when the order date was, and I was really not doing good. I should stop doing stuff when I'm not doing good. But that was my first time happening in two years now, three years of me having the store. I don't know, in, in the whole time. So that was the first time I switched. I was printing the labels and I had two packages and I switched the labels. So basically I sent her order to her and her order to her. So... When she messaged me, of course, right away, I packaged the right order. She doesn't need to send me anything back. I'm good, you know. I, I don't want anything. I just want to get your order out there so you get your item. I felt so bad. But also, I didn't feel super bad like I usually would. So that was a very good thing. I was proud of myself. Usually, I would beat myself up for two weeks afterwards every day. But I didn't. And that was so good. So I'm kind of getting better with that. I want this tool leftover piece. I will. Let me see if I can clip it. I'm going to go to my sewing machine later and sew it. So, yeah. So this is my adventures. <laughs> my adventures. Okay, what else do we do? I want to use up these. So can we please do it? Yep, we totally can. I have a lot of adventures. I barely leave my house. And I have a lot of adventures, guys. <laughs> Inside my house. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I, I'm living in here. Like the other day, I did 11 something thousand steps. I did not leave my house. <laughs> well, I left it to go to the backyard for a smoke. <laughs> but that's, that's about it. <laughs> you know? So... Which one is better? This one, this one. I think I'm going to do this one. Yeah, so every day is an adventure here. My husband got a toll violation notice. Not just one. Five of them came in the mail. Five. I almost lost my mind. We have like, I don't know if it's everywhere or not. Bay Area Fast Track. Like when you drive on the lane that is just for the people who pay or if you have more than one person in the car, which my husband doesn't, he goes to work. Nobody wants to go to work with him. He has to go by himself. <laughs> so yeah, he goes to work and then, you know. Oh, I kind of like it to make it a little more. Okay. Yeah, so he got five violation and one at once. And he has an account and he's paying all the other tolls, you know. So those days are violated, the days before are not, and the days afterwards are not. Even in the morning on the same day, he got no violation. Well, I called them up and they, they fixed it. But still, you can't give people like a heart attack like this. <laughs> they gave me a heart attack. Five. $25 each, which is what? $125? I don't have $125. I bought a vacuum. <laughs> so there is no more no more dollars left. <laughs> I, bu I bought stuff. I have no dollars. <laughs> yeah, but <laughs> yeah, sometimes it's just like every day. Every day things happen. Maybe I should drive to work to him. That would save us money. <laughs> you know, just sit in his car. So we don't pay fast track. So we don't pay toll. All I need to do is just be there in the car. Look, I have this little one leftover piece. The tiny one. And... Oh! Oh my god. Okay. I get... I don't know if people would understand or not. But I forget the name of my friend who always messages me on my videos. And I apologize, but I just don't remember. They asked me for my husband's birthday. I don't remember. My brain has been really bad. But she said she is jealous of my layering. And I'm like, you cannot be jealous of my layering. 
because I got no technique. <laughs> Please don't be jealous of my layering. Please just take a piece of something and <laughs> stick it on top of something else. And then you will get the same layering like I do. <laughs> because it's all about just sticking pieces on top of pieces. So, you know, but I was like, really? Somebody thinks <laughs> that my layering is so good? No, I don't want this. That was something. Maybe a ruffle. I think a ruffle would be too much on this. Because I, or I don't use this. One or two. I do not know. But I want to use this piece. I want to use this piece. Oh, let's let's see what, what tiny stuff. So all you have to do is just take tiny pieces of something and stick them on top of the other pieces and you will be just fine. Okay. Collect the trash and use it. <laughs> so that's, that's all I'm doing at least. There. I think that will be good. Yeah. Why not? Let's just stick this down and later I will go sew. But I will sew off cam whenever later. Ooh, I like this this side even more. It's always happening with me like that. I always like the back side more for some reason. Okay, so that's all it has to do. Okay, I think I'm done talking. <laughs> I told you everything that happened. <laughs> told you everything that happened. At least I ripped from Michelle's booklet that she doesn't need anymore. She wrote something on the back, but I love them as decoration. I have holes and everything. Okay. Did anything else happen to my... No. I can't wait to fill my freezer up. It's gonna be once I'm done here, I will probably go and organize. I will see. I have so much stuff to do. Oh, I wrote myself a new list. You know how I always tell you that to be able to manage. I have a hard time motivating myself. Plus, if I'm overwhelmed, I freeze. That's my response. My body just freezes. So if I have 10 things to do, my brain cannot decide where to start. And instead of just starting somewhere and doing something, it completely shuts down. And I waste so much time not doing anything. So I have to trick myself all the time. I have to tell myself all the time what to do. And once, you know, I, I write different lists or I set a timer or whatever. Whatever works for me, I will do. Whatever helps me. I will do but after a while my brain gets used to things so i have to switch up and this time i switched up last week i made myself a master list i told you about this right i feel like i did you know what the problem is and when i tell you that you will probably think oh yeah she she really gone crazy <laughs> but the problem is every night i go to bed I say my prayers, everything is dark, and then in my brain, I start processing things that happened, and I process them in this way. I talk to you. I talk to you like I do here on cam. <laughs> so I'm laying there with my eyes closed, and I tell you guys a story, as if I'm telling you the story here right now. And then once I do a video or something, I don't know if I told you the story on video someday or in my bed. <laughs> so uh, I can't tell anymore. Is this like me remembering that I told you this here or there? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But I talk to you. Well, you know, I just said you would think I'm crazy, but no, you know, I can tell that I am not crazy yet because you guys never answer. <laughs> when I talk to you in bed, you never answer. Once you start answering me, that's the point where I, I need to see a doctor. <laughs> but I talk to you every night, just so you know. <laughs> it's terrible. 
And then I don't know, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know if I said this before, if I didn't say this before. <sighs> yeah, that's me. <laughs> Guys, it's just, yeah. <sighs> it's because I'm, I was going to say I'm lonely. I'm not really lonely, but I think this here is my most honest and straight and easygoing talking. I absolutely have no filter when I talk here to you. I don't think like, oh, what will they say if I say this? Or oh, is this appropriate? Or, oh, you know, I, I have, it's like just talking. Talking from my soul is just there. I'm I'm being me, I'm being honest, I'm, I'm doing my thing, and it's so good. This is the only time where I can do that. And I think that's why I started processing my days by talking to you. Yeah, that could be it. Well, now you know. Okay, she got numbers on there. I want to put numbers on there too. Yeah, maybe I will even use the same ones she got because I have the numbers. Yeah, it's Tim Holtz. So, I don't know. That's one. And I don't know, you know what? Maybe I will even use the small one. Let's see, what do we have? Let's put these things back here just so you know they are there for next time Opa. okay so this is big i don't want to use this oh this is these are super big right what hmm i kind of like it in that one i don't know what we'll see what else do i have I have the specimen, the round one, if I wanted to. It doesn't look too bad. And then I have this one. Let's see if I have a round one of these. It doesn't look too bad. And then I could use this. I'm kind of torn. I don't know if I want to use one of the huge numbers. But I do have the smaller ones right here. Yeah, I think I'm good. Okay. Okay. Finally. I like my numbers. Hey, I'm going to finish all four. Are you proud of me? I'm so proud of myself. Okay. Oh, Alexa is going to remind me of something. Etsy shop. Yeah. I, I never forget my Etsy shop, but I still have a reminder in case I would ever forget to package orders, <laughs> you know. <laughs> I always make sure because today my, my USPS lady is going to come. So everything that I package, she's going to get. And then I make sure that everyone who orders today up until she rings my doorbell, I will run to my room and I will package all, everything up just so they get it sooner you know they can go with the same pickup and people get it sooner because nothing is worse than waiting of your craft supplies right i don't know if i want that i think i'm gonna cut this off Ta -da! cut it off and i'm just trusting only on the outside Pretty dark, but I'm gonna put um, my glaze on top later. Okay, so let's glue it down real quick. Ah, guys, I spoke so much. I feel so good now. <laughs> Sometimes if I don't talk at all, all day long, um, I message my husband and I tell him to prepare because I need I need to the words in my brain need to leave <laughs> they need to go out of my brain so he will have to listen uh, oh I'm so happy that we just slept through this 
very happy. I appreciate that, BJ. Thank you so much. You know, I will thank him in person soon once I'm done here. And thank you, Luna, too, because Luna protecting me here. She looks like a demon. <laughs> when she sleeps, sometimes her eyes just open up, but all you can see is red. <laughs> so she looks like a demon. Okay, so that's it, basically, right? And all I'm going to do, I'm just going to, um, the word there. So I'm going to sew. And then this could be a card. I don't know if I'm going to distress the back. Well, I might. Oh, this is written, but that's fine too. There's nothing personal and nothing you can really read. So I think it's fine. Yep. So all I'm going to do is use some glaze. Put it on top of each number or each label that i have here i could have put labels um from tracy fox also the mini labels but we're good and i will be done with that so quarry thank you so much i know i thank her but i'm, I'm pretty sure she's not watching this but you know still thank you for the inspiration that I did not really learn something new. Like, I don't know how to explain that without sounding like I'm not grateful because I'm very grateful for the inspiration. But sometimes that's all we need. We just need to look at something. And even if we have seen it 1,000 times in our lives, it can still inspire us. Especially, I have a hard time with my inspiration recently. Maybe because I'm so... I'm really busy. I really, really am. And my brain is so busy. And then I have a hard time calming down and thinking about something like crafting. But that inspires me. And I'm glad I've done two now from my screenshots. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Only 5,730 to go. <laughs> but that's fine. That's fine. I, at least I've done two. So... Proud of me, pat, pat my shoulder. <laughs> good girl, you did good. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed this, all of my stories here today. If you did, thumbs up, share, subscribe, and let me show you. You know, this looks so good with this glaze. I don't know, I like it a lot. Is it okay? It's okay. So, you enjoy your day, like I said. Hope you're crafting and healthy and happy, and I hope to see you soon. So bye-bye for now.